Hello, everyone. Um, I'm back. Um, tonight, I'm going to attempt to redeem a blue jean jacket that I did, messed up, and I'm going to try to fix it up, and I hope I can go over what I did mess up, and in the process, I'm just going to show you uh, how to put this one on a, a blue jean jacket. It's a favorite of mine. I did the beginning of this to show you how I did it on my computer to do the cut and everything. I did a few minutes on my computer, so the tape is right before this one. If you want to take a look at that, if you don't know how to, to do the, if you want to see how I did the cut on there. But right now, I'm just going to uh, continue with the weeding. I already did the lips already. And uh, this part right here, which was her collar, and her, this part her collar and her head was together on the Cricut. But I didn't want it to be black, I wanted it to be pink. So I showed you on the Cricut how I separated it from separated it from, so that's the collar, I separated it from her head. That's what I did in the beginning on there, in the beginning on the tape. And this is her face. Everything I'm doing today is in glitter. I like using glitter because it's durable. It's harder than using the regular. It's more easier to work with. You ain't got to worry about burning your, um, burning your material. Um, and I just like it because it's shiny. I do do other um, stuff that's not in glitter. But um, I'm going to do a his and hers. His and hers t-shirt for my niece. Because my niece just bought a Cricut. And I really want to show her how to do a his. And she wanted to order it. And I was like, mm-mm. It's time <laughs> for you to start learning how to do some stuff on your Cricut that you bought and you haven't even used yet. So, we're weeding this. This is her face, and I hope I didn't mess it up. Just one second. Why did it cut so far up at the top like that? I don't know, but I hope it laid down all right. Sometimes, y'all, I have to use my light, light right on my weaving because. I can't see that good. You know, sometimes you can't see. So my light is over here. Hold on just one second. I just got to get her lips off of here. And I think that's it. So I had to get her lips off of there. So you just take off her lips and just weed everything else. I always weed from corner to corner. Um, or whichever works best for you. The more you do it, the more you're going to get used to doing it. This was her earring. I did a lot of pink for that, and I didn't need to. But there was another little piece on here, I thought. But maybe not. Let me just check to make sure. Yeah, it was. So, supposed to be another little piece on here. I hope it come off with it because I sure don't see it. Oh, there it is. It's way over here. Okay, so, just weed from corner to corner. 
with just that one corner right there. It's just one little piece that's right there. And there it is right there. As you can see. And just keep on pulling it. So I think that's a waste to have that way over there. I could have moved it over, but I wasn't thinking. Okay, so that's her earring and that other little thing. I don't know what that is. Excuse me, but I'll find out. And then, this is her hair. This is her hair that I did in pink. Because, you know, they're wearing all kinds of color hair now. So, <laughs> they wearing all kinds of color hair now. You can do yours all kind of color. And you know what? That's what makes, makes everything unique. Do it the way you want to do it. You don't have to do it because it's brown. You want to make it brown. If it's black, you want to make it black. No. Do it. Try different stuff. Don't just do it because that's the way it looks. You'd be surprised at how sometimes you'll do something and how nice it will come out looking because of the way you did it. So that's her hair, and it's all done. And this was her face. I can see it. So I'm going to cut some of this off that I can save. Hold on. I don't want to cut off everything. I couldn't put my light right over the camera because it was making the picture too bright. Okay, so let's start from the corner with this. I don't know what some pieces that. And like I said, when you weeding, um, everything that's in white needs to be taken off. You'll get used to it. But everything in white should be weeded. Right now, I'm just weeding all of the outer part of her. That's all of the outer part of her. And this part where her collar was, remember when I did her collar? That has to be taken off. This is a popular uh, uh, image um, from Coco. I'm going to put the link in the bottom. This goes off. I think that's part, that gold part. And then she has an earring on here. Wait a minute, let me just do her face first. So I don't want to mess this up. Okay, so let's do her face. Let's take off her face. I thought some of her earrings was going to come off with that, but it's going to do that part right there. Got to be real careful not to pull off something that's supposed to stay on there. But if you do, you can always go back and say, hey, it, it, it got, it stayed attached to the vinyl. So go back and um, get it off the vinyl. Okay. And then, of course, her lips got to be weeded. I really need no light, but that's okay. Her lips. And there's her little lips. There's a little spot right here that needs to be weeded. Take that off. Then her hair, you seen me do her hair. All of those pieces that need to go in her hair gotta come out. Let me see this for a minute. Gotta come out of here. Sometimes you can lay it down there. You don't know what part's got to come off. But it should show you anyway, but I can't hardly see because I don't have my light. Okay, so this part needed to come off. Just pull it down. If something comes up, just take your finger and just pull it back down. This little part right here, pieces, some pieces over here, needed to come off. This is her hair part. 
comes down, just pull it back up. You'll know everything that needs to come off because it'll have, you know, of course, those little lines. And like I said, everything that's in white. And there's one more little piece right here that needs to come off. She's almost done. I just don't want to mess up her earring. Let me see. This coming off. I think. This little piece right here has some little pieces right here. Little pieces right here. And what else? Little pieces right here. All of these little pieces around her earring. Let me see what else. And then her earring should be right here. Okay. And she is done. Let me just, nope. It's one little piece right here. I need to put this by the light, make sure I get everything. Okay, hold on just one second. Okay, so she's all done now. And that's how she looks. She's real pretty, I like her. Um, she's by Coco. I can't remember the whole name, but I will put her on the bottom so you can find her. I sure you like it. Get my little board out the way. Now we can just start doing, doing it. Putting the um, image to the blue jean jacket. Now look, you see this little part right here? I had started this jacket one time and messed it up. But I was able to get the um, glitter off of there. But this little, wow, that, that just goes to show you how how long this stuff can stay on there. This little part stayed on there, so I hope it covers it up. But if it doesn't, so be it. Um, I still just want to show you how to do it. Okay, so I would put this as, much, as closest to the top as I can because... You might want to put something on the bottom, like some wording or something. And I got some wording that I hope is going to fit. Yep, it looks like it's going to just barely fit on the bottom. So let's put this all the way to the top. I could still see that stuff in the background, but I hope I could cover it up. Okay, so let's iron it a little bit and heat it up. Like I said, I'm going to try to redeem this jacket. I made one before, but it wasn't the same Im image. And I sold it already, so it's gone. But maybe I'll put that picture on here instead of um, this picture. Okay, so while we heating that up. Just heat it up a little bit. I know where I'm putting it at. I'm putting it right at the top. You can do so many things with these blue jean jackets. It's really cute. Okay, so it's going to go all the way at the top. I ain't going to throw this away. All the way at the top. And... Put it all the way at the top, and that looks like it's going to be centered okay. And you know the deal here, I would go about 25 minutes, 25 seconds. I always say minutes all the time, but about 25 seconds. Twenty-five seconds again. You know you can um, time your cricket, your uh, cricket press. I know I need a bigger one, but time will tell. <laughs> and twenty-five 
25 seconds. And a little bit over here, 25 seconds. And I hope when I put in all of my colors and everything, it'll color up that spot that um, got left on this blue jean jacket at the time. And that's about it. So let me see. And I love these blue jean jackets doing designs on the back of them. So, pull her up, and of course, that spot is still there, so I hope I can cover most of it up anyway. Okay, so let's do her collar, and her collar is pink. And if it don't, you, you guys are still get an idea on how to make it. Collins pink. Let's see if I'm getting this in there right. Show me if you can see. Bring this right over here for just a second. Make sure. Oh. I think that's about it. Okay, so do her collar for about 25 seconds. And I went out today to see if they had any blue jean jackets where I got where I originally got this one from. Of course, they didn't have no more. Not they have blue jean jackets for not for the price that I wanted to get it for. <laughs> they had them at BJ's for nine dollars and ninety eight cents, but then they went on sale, y'all, for four dollars and ninety eight cents. That's when I really should have stocked up on them. But and I made a couple, a few of them, and I sold a few of them. So, but. You know, anytime you see a sale like that, you really need to stock up on them. Like, I mean, four dollars and ninety-eight cents. You couldn't beat that. Okay, Let's see if this is ready. Yep, it's ready. Then let's do the face part. I think that's gonna cover up most of this. Okay, now I really need my lamp for this. I'm sure I get her. Oh, we, I hope I almost had it right. I almost had it. Okay. sure you get this lined up correctly so the lips and everything have been in there so I think that that's gonna do it
going over a little bit. Okay, I think that that is good. Let me see. I think that that's going to do that part right there. Okay, 25 seconds. so mad when I went up there today and I ain't had no more of these jackets with them. Okay. That's what that other piece was. That's her lips and her earring. Her earring and her other part of this thing right here. Go right there. Okay. So we're going to take this part off. Nope. See there? It didn't, wasn't a good 25 seconds. still see some of that part from where I messed it up, but that's okay. At least I'm showing y'all how to do it. Okay. So let's see if we can pull this up now. I don't know why this is not sticking, but I'm going to try to pull it up and then iron over it. Oh, no. I don't know what's going on. You know probably why it ain't sticking because... Well, let me try it one more time. Let it cool off a little bit. And then we can do, while we wait, we can do the wording. So the wording is going to go right here. And the wording is believe. Let me see. There's a piece on here that needs to go off. Wording is believe, so let's do that. Let me see. Because I was planning on putting some, and I'll show y'all how to do that too. Let me cut this down.
I think it's going to come up now. Let's see. Yep. Okay. So we finally came up. Yeah. And here go her lips. And let's pull this up a wee. I wanted to do that in silver because I'm going to show y'all in a few minutes. And then let's do her lips. Let's do these earrings first. When can I do? Yeah, let's, I'm going to do all three things. Where's the scissors at? Go to earring right here. Put that right there. Then the lips. Should I do the lips? I wasn't thinking I was trying to hurry up today. Red right there. And then this little piece right here is her earring. See from the thing that I messed up is right there. You can still see it, but that's okay. Okay, so we're going to do these three things. Okay, and let that cool off a little bit. And then the only part we have left, y'all, is the hair part, which is this part right here. And she is very easy to do, as you can see. And like I said, to, to see how I cut her and the size that I cut her and everything, that'll be on that first video. see a little bit of that right there and then part of that lip right there yeah messed it up that's okay okay now and there's so many things that you could do with this because you don't have to just stop there you could just keep on going all the way around this jacket putting whatever you want to put on there names you could put louis vuitton gucci all of that all kind of stuff on here um, or you can put, uh, you can even do Christian names, you know, stuff to do with, um, you know, names of the Bible, um, you know, you know, just do your thing, you know what I'm saying? Okay, let me see. I don't see, that didn't go on there right. I'm going to cut this like this. So I can make sure I'm doing this at least halfway right. I don't want it to be messed up all the way. Okay. Piece of her hair right here. Let's try it.
sure you get it on there, cause if you don't, it's showing up gonna be messed up. Still, man, it's coming up. Let me see. Let's see if I can get this on there right. Okay. Okay, let's try it. Somebody asked me on one of my videos that I am right on the um right on top of the vinyl. Yes, I iron right on top of the vinyl because I see that it doesn't hurt it. Um, I was gonna do this tonight. Uh oh, but I was gonna put it on a t-shirt. I don't know if y'all can see this, but since I can't move my camera this is a pillow you can't hardly see it anyway I'm going to do that on another day but I'm going to put it on a t-shirt instead of putting it on a pillow okay let's see what we got here Oh, good. I got it right on the spots that it needed to be on. Uh, see there? That's really cute. <laughs> Let me see. But, you can still tell a little bit right there that it got messed up. Now, the reason why I did believe in silver is because you can do more with this jacket really a lot more than what you think if it's coming up right i don't know if i used this last time but you can put i don't know these little um jewels on them wow a lot of gook is coming out of this one You could put these little jewels on there. Ooh. That's why I tried to do it in silver. And um, of course use uh, E6000 glue. And you get it from Michaels. Michaels all day got them. You can get them in gold. They got gold. All kinds of colors. Let me just stick it on there like that. And um, put these on there. Make it look a little dressed up. A little jazzy. Got a little jazziness to it. I made one like this for a friend. She bought it from me. Just stick them with E6000 glue so they, those won't come up. And just keep going all the way. Um, you can do you can do as many or as, as you know as many as you want. But I only did going down this way and going down this way. 
And I'm just showing you this part right here. I'm not going to do the whole thing because I'm going to finish it on my own. And then when I get finished with it, I'm going to show you a picture of it on YouTube. This will be the, uh, the picture that I show. And that's it. This is really done except for this part right here. And like I see it, it's E6000 glue. Ooh. Use it and make sure you, you know, put enough on there to make it real sticky. Make sure it sticks to this jacket. And just keep going all the way down. And I'll show you the um, results when it's done. And as far as I'm concerned, the jacket is all done. It was easy peasy. That's what I really wanted to show you. How easy it was to do. For the newcomers. And I just put believe right here. The words believe. Okay, I'm going to finish this up. And then I'm going to put the picture up there. And I'm going to upload this to YouTube. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.